Want to watch the uncut version? An early access of the next two or more episodes? All of it are now available on Patreon. Hey guys, welcome to my channel today. We are watching How to Get Away with Murder Season 1, Episode um, 13. And I am excited for this as usual. Last episode, man, they frame Nate. Or at least, um, Annalise framed Nate. And he's the one who got arrested because they thought that he's the one who killed Sam. But damn damn we still got three episodes and i have a feeling that something will have to go down towards the end of this season so yeah let's just dive into this episode here we go detective nate Leahy was arrested at his residence in connection with the death of middleton university man. professor sam keating a man whose wife mr Leahy reportedly had an affair with they must be you must feel really guilty about this I feel bad for him though. He doesn't deserve this. They just ruined this man's life. That's just bad and sad. Do you know VIP when you see one? VIP? Your boss came out of my V and her daddy's P. Oh. To show <laughs> oh, it's Annalise's mom. mom. Oh, my daughter, where is she? Your no cat, <laughs> sorry ass husband. Who well, I said, don't marry. Couldn't keep his Peter in his pants and went and slept with a white woman. Oh that my fool God. goes and kills the white woman. And you, now, ain't got no husband, <laughs> ain't got no boyfriend, and you hold up in this bed like the Queen of Sheba. Had a back cover. <laughs> well, I'm all into this one. I have to get I like her. his grandson to come on. But this will ruin me. I'll be forced onto some sexual predator registry. But I didn't do what that man says, I promise you. I didn't rape him. Imagine you go into the hospital for a routine surgery. Imagine the degradation, the humiliation. That's what Chad Manning felt when Jolene Samuels raped him at his most vulnerable. It's about power, and anyone can be a victim. Of slanderous allegations that are unfounded and could very well endanger her livelihood. For that reason, you should find Jolene Samuels guilty. <laughs> Not guilty. That was a slip, excuse me. Oh my god. <laughs> So, did your doctors report that you had a TIA that day? Yes. A TIA is a small stroke. Possible side effects include memory loss, vision impairment, and disorientation, all of which could explain why Mr. Smalley would have thought he saw something he didn't. Hmm. The witness can be excused. So, what really happened though? Okay. Bonnie's doing well. <laughs> what are you doing? You can't just take Sam's suits. Uh, these suits are too good to go to waste. Stop it. Talonis can use them for his job. So oh I my god. Stop it. These are a man's possessions. They're not just cheap hand-me-downs that you put in a poor box at church. Don't sass me, anime. Annalise. Anime <laughs> is a beautiful name. Mama, how many times? <laughs> Have I asked you to call me? This is the first no, time. No, this is not the first time. First time in person. I never been invited up in here, have I? You get rich, you give yourself a rich name. Mm. Annalise. So Anna May. It's Anna May. Mm. Something else your mama gave you from the pull box. I'm not saying that the name wasn't good enough. I'm telling you that I changed it. Respect the fact and honor your request. Who the hell do you think you are, Oprah? I'll wipe your ass and I'll call you anything I want. Fair enough. It's your mom. You know what, Mama? You go ahead and you take Sam's things. 
A girl like me doesn't get too many opportunities to have mind-blowing sex in her life. So when I got the chance to screw one of the sexiest men I've ever seen, I jumped on it. Oh my god. Straddled it. And I held on for dear life. It was truly the best sex I've ever had. And get this, he was one of my patients. We lost this. Until I was accused of this, they all think I'm a rapist and I'm not. And I know that's hard for you to believe, especially since I lied to you. But please, don't give up on me. We need to prove that the sex between Jolene and Chad was consensual. We're going to need to prove that Chad is a worse liar. Why would it you lie no about being raped? Not to settle this out. Do you talk back to Annalise when she asks you to do something? Shut up. Do your work and find something that shows Oof. the Chad story isn't true. You mean slut shame the guy? Exactly. Teacher's pet, y'all. Only because the teacher's a loser. Oh, someone be jealous. Would you sleep with her? Bonnie? I, I don't know. Why, I, why would you ask me that? Not Bonnie, our client. <laughs> right. uh, I don't know. It depends how many brewskis I have. I'll keep you for one minute. You got some boy child up in here sniffing your drawers. Mama, can you give us a moment? You out. Mama, that was one of my students. Mm -hmm. Somebody's always a student. Somebody's always the teacher. That's how sex works best. Oh, my God. You okay? <laughs> yeah. I just have to tell her my son ate kill Sam. Get Annalise out of her sick bed, wherever the hell she is, so she can fix this. No. Excuse me? We're not settling. The hospital isn't my client. Now, if you'll excuse me. Fight the power, Bon. It's a case about a man who says he was raped by a woman. Oh, now that's crazy. <laughs> Why, you don't think women are capable of that kind of violence? Hell no. Women? Other things, yes. But rape? Mm -mm. Well, not. Man will put on this planet to take things. You no, know, they take your no, money, it's possible to women to, com take to woman commit a crime as well. They can put their grabby hands on. That's men. Oh, no, mama. Right. Let's not go round and round like this. Let's just dive right in. Did you know? Uncle Clyde is dead. Did you know what he did to me? Oh. He's dead. Did you hear me? And the Lord made sure he got what he deserved. Oh. Oh, that's what this is all about. Damn. He said this thing that happened to me, what you ignore, is why I am the way I am. Your Aunt Lynn was got out by her first grade school teacher. Reverend Daniels got me what? at the choir practice. I told you, men take things. They've been taking things from women since the beginning of time. I learned anime belonged in a hand-me-down box. Go oh, home, Mama. Sure. I don't need to. <sighs> it's really hurtful for a mother to hear, though. Tried this before, maybe even with other hospital personnel. That a, so their child telling them they don't need them? Any notations were made about it? I recently discovered that Mr. Tucker and Mr. Manning here are lovers. Oof. Here are emails between Mr. Manning and Mr. Tucker where they've shared intimate photos of one another. As the hospital's attorney, Mr. Tucker had inside knowledge as to which cases would force the hospital to pay out big. Whoa. A salacious rape charge. This is slander. They chose my client knowing she was timid and would make an easy mark. Do you think a motion is in order here? We would like to file a motion to dismiss the charges against Ms. Samuels. Granted, you're free to go. <laughs> oh. oh my god, that's good. Yeah. Your name to ice cold because Bonnie went through. I'm proud of her. Amazing. I mean, I knew you could pull it off, but who knew you could build rope and dope? As soon as you spent, Ollie comes back to life just. <gasps> oh, really? Right here. <laughs> Really here <laughs> on the on the parking. <laughs> Why did you drag us all here again? Oliver wanted to meet you guys. Your boyfriend knows who we are. Uh, no, and he's not my boyfriend, but I do like him and would like to get laid by him, so everyone be on their best behavior. Hey. Oliver! <laughs> wow. Feels like I just got off the plane. 
Hawaiian in Hawaii. Where are all the lays? <laughs> Oliver, meet Michaela, Laurel, and Wes. Hey. Guys, please don't humiliate me. Okay. Oh, we wouldn't dare. I got his arrest report. They... She said he had a, a nervous breakdown. It actually was a drug overdose. But you put him in a mental institution. Mm. Maybe she didn't know that. Maybe, but the night it all happened, it was the, the same night Lila was murdered. Mm. Sam killed Lila. Wes. What if? In court. What if I was wrong? You weren't. What if I was? She did it, then we did what I did. Yeah. Sam dying was his own fault. And Nate's in jail now. And. Came out of your room and I know what he had done. It was a big man. Loved his lick and his hooch. I go by. I put it out. And one night, not too long. Did you after, kill him? He fell asleep on the couch, drunk as a skunk, that cigarette hanging out of his mouth. And mm. that night, that house that I loved so much. Burnt to the ground. And oh. your Uncle Clyde burnt right with it. You gotta do what you gotta do. Even if all you've got is a long match and a very flammable hooch. Oh my god. Damn. Damn. Oh, damn. Got goosebumps. <laughs> oh. Man, that's really good. What about this? You know her, right? Her name's Rebecca. Wes, stop. Was she with you that night? Did you do drugs together? What did you say? What? Say it again. What? What? <gasps> She's wet. So, sh oh my God, what? Oh, so she, oh, got goosebumps. So she's actually, oh, so it's possible that she's the one. Oh my God, she played all of us, all of them. Oh my God, all of this happened because of her. Oh, man. Ooh, love this episode. I love Annalise's mother. We learned a lot of terrible stops from um from their past, you know. Man, this episode's good. Bonnie, ah, uh, we've seen Bonnie handled um her f first case. Um, at first, um, she was just not on the game, you know. Um, she's being sloppy, but then towards the end, she won the case, and I I don't know. I just feel proud for that, proud of um, for Bunny, you know, because I th I think she's um she needs that because she's maybe she's been thinking that she's not worth it because she's always got Annalise or Annalise always be the one to um ha uh, she, uh, uh Annalise is the one who's uh, handling it, you know, the cases. And yeah, I love it. I love this episode. That revelation, though. Well, it's not really a revelation, but um, Laurel and Wes is actually um, 
into something. They found out that maybe it's possible that Rebecca killed Lila. Man. 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 But Lila though, um, Rebecca though, she knows everything. She could easily just tell the, the police that Wes killed Sam and everything. But I don't know if she's gonna do that because of obviously they're gonna tell um, the police about her as well. Probably killing Lila. Man, this is just all a mess. But man, this one's good. So there you go, guys. This is How to Get Away with Murder, Season 1, Episode 13. Let me know your thoughts about this one in the comments below. And hit the thumbs up button if you love and like this reaction of this show. And please subscribe to my channel for reactions every week. Uncut version of this one is on my Patreon as well as the early access of the finale. By the time that you're watching this, I'll already watch the last two episodes of this show. So if you want to check it out right away, you can head into my page. It's on the description down below so you can go there and everything is on my patreon page so yeah i'm just so so thankful for all of you guys for all of your support and thank you thank you for watching for more reaction videos just click here to subscribe <laughs>